morning again, Robert. Okay, um, our previous game was against Scott's team. We, um, overall our performance was good. We walked away with, with a good amount of points. We got the result we wanted. However, we started very slow. I think you'll remember from the game, the first half was a very slow half. So we, bef the structure of the session, we're going to run through the stats and then we'll go through some video, some video footage on some of the problem areas and some of the trials scored. Okay, if you look at the possession, uh, straight away it can show you from the first half, oh, both halves are pretty much the same. They did have a lot more of the possession than us. Compared to us, 56% they had in the first half. In the second half they had 57. Um, and if you look at the field position, uh, they then, with that, with that possession, they were in our half 75% of the time in the first half. And we were in their half 25% of the time. Same in the, sec in the second half, they were 60, we were 40. But as we go on, you'll see that when we were there, we came away with points in the second half. But we were still stuck in half a bit, and all of our attack was coming out from deep. Okay, if we look at the set piece, everything in blue is us. So we had seven scrums, five, we won five of our own, they won two of ours. In the first half for them, they won two of their own scrums and we won four of their scrums. So in terms of scrums, at the, at the, in the first half we dominated. We could have tried to secure a bit more of our first phase of the set piece, um, but we did well to, dis to disrupt their set piece in the first half. Second half was pretty much evens. Everyone secured their own ball. We secured five out of our scrums, which is good. A good improvement from the first half. Lineouts. Same thing, follows the same style. So six of our lineouts, we won. They won one of ours. We won two of theirs, they won four of their own lineouts. Overall lineouts pretty good. If you look at the percentage, we had a, it was about 85% success rate in our lineouts. So it was good. Um, and we did again we did well to disrupt them a bit. Um, and then second half, a lot less lineouts and they secured their ball. We could have maybe tried to disrupt them a bit more, yeah. But that's all right. Okay, missed tackles. Yeah, we're only looking at our missed tackles. We're not looking at theirs because it's, it's irrelevant for us. First off, we had 16 missed tackles. Like, I'm sure you can agree with me that's too high. Mm -hmm. Second off, seven missed tackles. Came down a bit, but still something we can get, we can get lower. I've got a lot of footage we'll cover just now. And we'll, we'll, we can look at tackle techniques and see why they're missing those tackles. Handling. Um, us first them, they uh, knocked the ball on a lot more than us and it shows you that's why they couldn't get the points they were looking for. And they were getting into not necessarily vital positions, but when they had good go forward, they were coughing up. So we can be a little bit grateful for that. We were pretty clean. Two handling in the first half and one in the second half. Very good. We did well to hold on to what ball we had. Okay, penalties conceded. So we'll pie chart. So at the tackle, we conceded three. In general play one. And here's the problem. At the ruck, we conceded ten penalties. And if, if I show you, if we go to we quickly jump to turnovers by us, look how many we had at the ruck. We only had two turnovers at the ruck. So that turnovers we won? Turnovers we won. So we we made the turnover. So if you look at the amount of penalties. Compared to the amount of whoops, sorry, compared to the amount of turnovers at the rack, we need to tighten up our discipline there. Yeah. Can I just ask you yeah. is that that penalty is not divided into attack defence, like so it's no, penalties. That's your yeah, general. Okay. Yeah. Um, and then yeah, okay. So general play pretty good at tackle. It's good. Okay, then turnovers by us, if we finish off general play, we have twelve I think a lot of that was um, offside, not 100% sure. If you want more information on where the, on how those occurred, I can give it to you. Um, okay. Is that we yeah. conceded? Sorry, sorry, sorry. This is, sorry. Sorry, let me get my words right. I was still on penalties. These are turnovers by us in general play. So, but what I included here is these general play turnovers include kicks. Okay. So, it, it might be, it won't give a good representation. Then, at the scrum, four at the more one, the line two. We've already covered those, um, the line and at the, at the scrums, we looked at those just now. 
Okay, this is our turnovers conceded, so this is where they turn over. General play six, so you can see we kicked away a lot less ball than they did, um, which is good because we had what low position we had, we tried to hold on to, and you'll see in the second half that turned into points from not giving it away. There is, though, there was still some, we'll, we'll get to in the video, but some kicks that should have been held on to um, that we gave away. Okay, and then at scrum two, at line two, we've again, we, we did. So we were pretty good at the ruck. We were able to protect our ball. They only had one turnover at our ruck. So overall, we did well, I, in my opinion, to protect our ball. Um, yeah, so let's move on then. Okay, this is looking at the rucks. Again, you'll see this won't correlate. The two, yeah, we conceded one, and then they, we've lost two of rucks. That's probably due to it. I think it was a penalty that the other one came from. Penalty from our side. So that gave them possession. <coughs> but overall, 31, we secured 90, that's about 94% of our own rucks, which is really good. Um, them as well, they had also a very high percentage that they secured. They had 54 rucks, we only disrupted and turned over four. So I think this is an area we could maybe focus on. Try and, if you saw, well, if you looked, if, you, if we go back, we only had. This is turnovers excluding our penalties. So we only had two again, and look at our, our penalties. So, yeah. Okay, and then from the stats side, before we head into the videos, just to conclude, just from looking at the stats, we need to hold onto the position, onto our position, sorry, um, and play in their half. But from the video, you'll see that we we did well to, to attack out of, the, out of um, our own half. Um, we had a good set piece throughout the game, um, disrupted them nicely. In the second half, we slowed down a bit, um, but we can. But it was, it was still generally very good. We need to reduce our missed tackles by a lot. We will cover um, the missed tackles area. I think that was a big, one of our big issues in this game. If we play a, a, a stronger side, they might, um, uh, in, um, they might make use of those. Discipline at the breakdown. We spoke about penalties versus our rock turnovers. Okay, there's, we need to be more clinical there. And then our scrums were very good. We did well to disrupt them. Um, we held our own. We could have maybe in the first half held a bit more of our own, but we did well to in some vital areas. You'll see there's a video as well. Some vital areas turning over the ball at a scrum, and they're in a very good attacking position. Okay, so we'll go quick to the videos. from the stats side, I believe. No, I think that. Okay, we'll look at the first half first, obviously. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna sit here and go my because I need to operate the laptop now. So our first one up is a tackle, miss, and uh, here I said just too high, needs to get lower if we look there, needs to get a bit lower, it's up too high, the ball carrier is high, cut tackle, you had support there. Um, yeah. And then yeah, we did really well, we counter attacked under a lot of pressure, the following up coach tag, um, I'll let this plan and I'll get you, it's, it's at the end of this movement, but good composure here. Ball we'll kick back. Notice that there was space out on the far side. Good counter attack. Okay, and then yeah, the chip. Okay, maybe still an option at the time. He did have support, but if we watch further. At this point, we need to secure the ball again. We now everyone's got front foot ball. He, okay, he tried to, unfortunately tried to secure it, he missed it. But then the next arriving player needed to pick it up and set up fades. Because they were completely on the back foot. Mm -hmm. And then we chipped it forward for 50 for I, I think the reason why I didn't pass there was I think there was players between them, the fifth, uh, the, the third yeah. team, and he chipped before he chipped kick. So I think there was players with C uh, yeah. C yeah. That, 14 was too close. Yeah. 
he couldn't pass to a guy at the back. And nine was too far, so I think that's the reason for holding on to the ball or chipping it away. Yeah. No, that that um that chip's okay. I'm just the second one, the second mm -hmm. kick that we should have maybe just the yeah, clean clean up and then set up first. We had them all of them dropping. But very good attack from deep though. This is um, one of our lineouts that I pulled. This is one of our chain marks, if you want to call it. Okay, we off a good lineout. We set up well, form up the more, and everyone falls in. Very good driving more. And we came away with seven, five points there, I think. Yeah, this happened, this occurred twice in a, in a red zone. Um, at the ruck we had the numbers to, to set up our blockers. The blockers were just, they didn't spread up well enough and it put our kick under a lot of pressure. Um, if you watch from there. We've got, there's no blockers and it puts a kick under a lot of pressure. Also, I uh, went to the wrong kicker. I actually had to pick that up now. Mm -hmm. Went to the wing. Okay, and then straight afterwards, still we still under pressure. Same thing happens. We don't have blockers, and we allow them just to put too much pressure on us. Okay, um, but we still we still did well to to protect our, our line there. We never came. They never got points there. Uh, that's sorry. We just did that. Okay, this is another attack. This is just um, needs to track better. Number eleven. Um, he, he attacked the he attacked the um, the player rather than holding and just drifting and keeping. You'll see there. I said track, track and keep him on the outside shoulder because he look. It looks like he, he can't get to the tackle. But if you if we go back and watch from the beginning, you'll see him coming from right there. He just needs to track better this way. Track better this way. You see him pushing up and then keep him and then. We had the cover to work into that trial. I think communication as well. Communication issues. Okay, scrum then. This is one of the scrums I wanted to talk about. Scrum in our 22, they have the ball and they will get the tight end. Very good. It was a very good scrum. Um, especially get us out of pressure. Okay, okay. And you can see how the back, how the locks. They dipped and pushed up and dropped them completely off. And then we came away with the clinics as well. So very well done there. Again, disrupted their set piece and that did us deal. We've got another four missiles. Two of the tackles occur in the same area. You can see straight away where that is. It's way too high. Okay? And then if we frame by frame it, watch 12, he uses his arms in the tackle rather than getting his shoulder stuck in. Just trying to pull him, pull him down or hold him up. He needs to get that shoulder stuck in. So I'll just play that real time. Good there. Okay, should have been, should have been brought down a lot easier with the two boys. Should just double hit him rather than try to pull him down. Okay, that was reviewed. Okay, there again, um, head down too early, and he's almost lunging at the, at the player. He needs to keep, needs to keep the feet moving. Okay, he needs to keep his feet moving, head up through the tackle. You'll see, yeah, he pushes up. Flat foot today as well. Yeah, gets his head down, and he's lunging, and keep the head up and work into contact. Um, and then this tackle, again too high, you get the shoulders down. Okay, basically from, from the tackles we can, throughout, throughout the, the missed tackles, it was either a tracking issue, getting flat footed or um, too high in the, in the contact situation. Um, here we got lucky, I'm going to go back a little bit and we can just watch You'll see with the next couple of coach tags, there was just a, something happened with the with the boys' morale. They weren't, it wasn't up. You'll see, watch on this defense situation. This was the last part of the first half. Yeah. They're all kind of just hanging around. No one's really 
trying to defend and then we just got lucky. There's acres of space. And we got a bit lucky with a couple of guys that worked hard to cover, but we defense wasn't set up. If we I set up a look at the sketch quick there. Look at the space outside there. Two defenders out wide, everyone just kind of bunching, just la lazy defense, just a, a lack in concentration. But something like that can be vital if we're playing against a, a, a strong opponent who will, will come away with points in that situation. But I think the boys just need to wake up a bit there. Um, and you'll see they, they scored shortly after that. Again, you'll, you'll see now. Sorry. Yeah, now there's the penalty. Quick tap. This is a quick tap try. Yeah, this is a quick tap try. Guys turn their backs, no one trying to get back. That's again just after that <coughs> back session. And then I want you to watch the body language of them walking back. Walking back after that try. It was just a temporary temporary slump there in their, in their uh, confidence, I think. Um, yeah, I'll play a quick video and see everyone's shoulders, heads down. Walking, the the um, five was there. Someone needs to step step up there, just lift lift their lift their spirits a bit more. And this was shortly after. This is Dale. I pulled this. Um, you'll see there. I said ball away from contact. Step ball away from contact. Step one. Protect our ball. Watch the clip. You'll see Dale goes. He makes a nice break, um, and then he doesn't protect the ball. Our frame by frame, it there. Ball in the wrong hand needs to be in the other hand and defend the contact. And you'll see there, number there, number fifteen doesn't even need to make a tackle. He just gets his shoulder in, rips the ball out. Okay, so in a situation like that, it's important to protect the ball because we've got the support coming. They're all falling back, and then protect the ball, get down, clean, quick ball, come away with points. Okay, so let's quickly. We'll get into the second half. Anything, anything from the first half you'd like to see? Yeah. No. It's, it's. But um, like I said, the first half we started very slow. Um, I don't know what you said to the second half, but they different team in the second half. Not sure it's Twenty-eight points we scored in the second half. There's more. Yeah, it's one score is 45. I think we went in the whole time 17 10. No, 10 8. Um, no, it's, it's, it's 18. No, it's 28. 28. Yeah, 28. So it's right, eh? No. Okay, I, don't, I didn't pull as much from the second half. Um, as you know, we stopped We stopped at the second half. Okay, so this. Oh, yeah. Okay, this I pulled out. Let's go, sorry, let's go right back a bit. Kick. Okay, this is off the, off the uh, 22. Very good chase, good solid line. They try to spread the ball, but our defense is well spread throughout. So we want to pull that because I just think from. That's the start of the first half. Complete. If we looked at what this, this, the sorry, start of the second half. If we looked at the defensive shape when the first half ended, big improvement there. They had very good defensive line, and they weren't going to get in to the end. Um, second one. Okay, this I would call it a little bit controversial. I think the pass looked good, but if we play. It's a very good piece of, of attack, very good hands to fix the defenders, out the tackle. I'm not sure if that pass was forward, but the ref pulled through it. Yeah. But yeah, very good play again, very good attack. Very nice. Man. We would have come over with points there if not cool. But the, yeah, that's rugby for us. Okay, this, I was just just wondering if this was a correct decision. He's more or less in the middle of the field. We know on this day the wind was quite strong. And the wind was coming towards me. So it's coming downfield this way. 
So just one leaf so more than you most keep out. So it's to keep the other didn't keep Yeah. Out. But it's because the wind was coming across. So you try to go for distance, the wind kept it in. So um I just wonder if he uh, I think it's a bit difficult to kick it to open side. So maybe just side. yeah, maybe shorten his case. Yeah, just go wind. Go out for accuracy rather than distance. Okay. Alright. Um Okay, yeah now I pulled pulled one of our tries. Let's go back. This was Harry, very good try. We played from the build up. So the set piece. Okay, good work by Mone, spots it. Harry loops around and he's long coming. Hold on to the ball bar. Very good try. Okay, we know he scored a couple, he scored a, and made a couple of very good breaks in this game. This game, tackle miss, too high, getting contact, just getting brushed off. Okay, yeah, again, another very good chase. <coughs> Go back on the kick. One of those up, good chase by the outside three, and they shut him down while well there. He thinks he knocks it off. Okay, uh, we get a turn over here, and it all came from a very good chase. Okay. Okay, this we scored, but was it the question I asked is was a kick really necessary? It worked, but we had uh, is this Harry's kick? Yeah. I the crossbow. It's a foot pass and a kicker. Yeah. Yeah, true. Because we had, yeah, but it worked. Yeah, but I think the other left was on the middle. Yeah, it yeah, might have been safer just to just to use the, the hands. So just then, they begin just some decision making. Okay, this is, let's actually, let's skip with this. We're not going to finish on with that. Um, that's another missed tackle. Let's, okay, let's just play it quickly, actually. Um, another missed tackle. And again, was just tracking, just tracking, coming up too quick, and then getting himself flat footed. Shorten the strides, keep the feet yeah, up. Yeah, the focus more on technique rather than the yeah. instruction. Okay, then we'll just to finish on a light note. We'll let's pull some of the second off tries. Okay, this was a nice build up as well through the phases. A good work then going forward, attack the same side was well done. They would, would just like to get a little bit cleaner, quicker ball, but it's fine, it worked out to me. A couple of slip tackles on the car. A good try. Okay, we looked at the second try. So look at this one. Back a little bit. This was a game off a turnover. From our half, like we spoke about, good break by Harry, dummy inside, sets it up. And the camera gets a bit blocked now, but again, very good try. See what I spoke about at the beginning, we attacked out of deep, off turnovers, we counted really well. Is this, this set up for the third try. Good loop around. Oh, sorry, we actually looked at this one. So the cross, but like we saw there again, overlap was there, now this will get. Okay, and then the last try before we ended footage. This was, oh, sorry, this was there. Let's see this. Okay, defense is there. Not much we could do, but no. Yeah, soft, soft try, but it's fine. Okay, is there anything you, any questions from your side? That concludes my session. I think what we picked up is that we need to work on our defense, mm -hmm. and we, especially on our defense, more, more tackling, tackling, more yeah. technique tackling, one on one tackling. Composer, I think uh, we're over eager in our first half. Yeah. We need more composure and attack. 
and just settle down. I mean, I think first half was more a mind shift, or the second half was more mind shift than not a technical shift. Because there was no urgency in the first half. Yeah, we saw at the those last five minutes. Yeah, so, so uh, yeah, I think it's a good overall performance. Second half. Yeah, second half we started slow. And I think the stats also also reflect that. So but uh, what's worrying for me is that we're not we they're not a they're a very attacking side we play against and they kick the lot as well. But we can keep position enough throughout mm -hmm. the game. It's nearly 50 50 if you look at the position. Yeah. And we play it right. Most of our tries came from our own half. Maybe you play more. See, there's more. It's nearly 50 50. And uh, maybe play more rugby in their half. Can we increase that 25 25%, 25%? Yeah, 25% for the first. Yeah, I increase that. First and I think that was maybe the issue in the first half as well. Yeah, we were. If you Because we're struggling, mm -hmm. we're not getting out of our own half. Yeah. Especially if you want to compete in survey, it's something you need to look at. Okay. Okay. That's it all right.